Hi and welcome. My name is Daniel, and today I'll be teaching you how to use expressions in everyday situations. Our topic for today is you'll be hooked on these fishing expressions. First, let's learn some keywords that are included in this lesson. Addiction. The state of being unable to stop doing or using something. For example, smoking is an addiction that can lead to cancer. Hook. A curved piece of metal that is used to catch fish or to hold something. For example, the man carefully removed the hook from the fish's mouth. Responsible. Being the main cause of something. For example, I am responsible for the project's failure. Opposite. Completely different from one another. For example, they are looking in opposite directions. Bait. Food used for attracting and catching animals. For example, live worms are sometimes used as bait for fishermen. You'll be hooked on these fishing expressions. Humans have been fishing for thousands of years. Here are some fishing expressions that you don't need to be a fisher to use. If someone really likes or has an addiction to something, you can say they're hooked. This expression comes from fishing hooks, because usually, once a fish is hooked, it can't stop itself from being pulled out of the water. So if your friend is always playing a video game, you could say, you're really hooked in that game. If you're on the hook for something, it means you are responsible or will have to pay for it. The opposite is true if you are off the hook. This comes from when a fish is on the hook because it will probably be killed. But if it gets off the hook, it gets away. If you broke your friend's video game and they wanted money for it, they might say, you're still on the hook for that video game. But if you then gave them a new game instead, they might say, okay, you're off the hook. Worms are a popular bait for fish, and they used to be sold in cans. Once you open a can of worms, it's very hard to close it again because the worms won't go back in. So we can use this expression to talk about when you do or say something that seems simple but causes problems. So if you were to mention that your friend also broke one of your games a few years ago, they might say, oh, don't open that can of worms. You don't want to fight about it again. Which of the expressions did you find interesting? Give your answer by commenting down below. If you learned something new today or enjoyed listening, please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and always take care.